welcome to my channel. My name is Tamara, and can you believe I found this fabric for a dollar twenty? Man, I love thrifting. That is one of my, the major reasons I love going thrift store shopping for everything. You just never know what you're gonna find. So I'm just making sure I have enough fabric for the kimono. I'm also checking the stretch to make sure that it's gonna be not too stiff and drape nicely. And then for my actual pattern, I'm just using an old kimono that I already own. This is a super cute, really comfortable kimono. And as you can see, it's pretty simple. It's like basically a square. I'm just holding the kimono so that I can go ahead and use it as my pattern and pop it on top of my vintage fabric. And then you'll see here, I'm doing a kind of like half fold. By doing this fold, I'm able to get my one big back piece. And then with the leftover fabric, I can then sandwich that piece and then lay my front pieces on top of it and get my two front pieces. I'm just making sure to cut the fold so then that separates it and gives me my two front pieces. So once all my pattern pieces were cut out, I pinned them all together, did a quick try on, made sure that the kimono was just the right length, and then got to sewing. Once everything was all sewn and the seams were done, I went ahead and pressed all my seams. And I always put a piece of fabric down so that I, you know, don't burn my fabric. So my inspo, my fabric, and my kimono. And here's the big reveal. Look how cute it is. I absolutely love it, you guys. It's so comfortable and soft, and it drapes really nice and it looks so cute with shorts, although I'm wearing pants there. But yeah, I'm so happy with how it turned out, and I hope you enjoyed my DIY tropical kimono, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.